So it's possible that that's a, a big channel and we don't know how old it is. But then up here, we've got all our nice river banks, very similar to what we had on the north side in Fiskerton. Um, so we would expect to, to find some prehistoric material, certainly in, in, the heart, in the third of the field near to the river. So it looked really, really hard. But I must say, there's not a lot in the field. Like Fiskerton, um, we're going to use a system of, we'll just pace ourselves out so we're standing sort of approximately 10 metres apart, 10 paces apart, and then if everyone, we'll start from here, if everyone uses that method of choosing your own point on the horizon to, to, and stick with it, don't try not to get too confused, um, and then just walk, use that point on, on the horizon to keep yourself straight, and again, like we did last time, um, just walk a few metres, either sort of zigzag along your central line, um, so that you're, we're getting quite a good, you know, a, a good sample area. Members of Washington Archaeology Group are all volunteers who have a mutual interest in archaeology. They have carried out the fieldwork systematically to ensure that the results are to a high standard. <laughs>